Blue. And as always, to the next live. I'll talk to y'all later. Peace. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday, Galatians. Good morning. Good morning. Let me sit here for a second, I'm trying to do some things before I go out. And of course, you know, you click on the TV as usual and you, good morning, girl. And you got to hear motherfucking horse mouth, fucking muskrat. Uh, you know, like early in the damn morning. Good morning. Good morning. I'm just, you know, when I tell my stories, Galatians, when I come on to tell my stories, it's about what I know. It's not about what another motherfucker know. It's about what I know. What you and, and, and what all of these people or whatever perceive of, of, of how they choose to intake the narration of it, I can't help that, right? But what pisses me off, seriously pisses me off with this goddamn rat mouth ass bitch. Yeah, this rat man, rat mouth ass bitch who always think that she knows. Like she know, no. Bitch don't know shit. You not you don't have my ears. You don't have what I know. You don't have it. The this bitch and I and I'm telling y'all, bitches like that irritates the fuck out of me. Her whole motherfucking persona irritates the fuck out of me. First of all, trying to make something into what it was not is the first thing that pisses me off about this loud mouth ass bitch. <laughs> bitch, I'm in Wisconsin, bitch. That's where the fuck I'm at. Ain't no, ain't no fucking secret. You done, you done looked it up. Or you can find your motherfucking way, just like the rest of them. If your heart feeling like it's pumping that motherfucking blood, and I'm up underneath your fucking skin, find your way. Find your way. I'm in motherfucking Wisconsin, bitch. That's where the fuck I'm at. You got the address and all that stuff. I, I know where you're at. Use it. Use that motherfucker. That's all you have to do. Nothing but opportunity and fucking air out here. That's it. This bitch will take a whole fucking story and turn it into shit that she wants to be and spur out her fucking mouth. Like, you talking about stupid. You talking about a narcissist. Bitch, you passed the borderline of that shit. Period. You passed the borderline fucking YouTube streets and you then I'll say this and she'll come back and go well no you think that I'm all of that bitch I don't think nothing worthy about your motherfucking ass nothing didn't know you the same way that you're able to sit out here with your fucking stories bitch so can everybody else and you just met one it's called I'm called one papoose out here bitch that's what I'm called 
in the same way. And I'm going to tell this bitch over and over and over and over again. That same way that you can get down, bitch, I can get down the same motherfucking way. I guess we have to figure out who the motherfucking ruthless is. Who ruthless? Who's ruthless with the shit? I guess. But ain't, 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 there's no need to take it there. This bitch, you done took a whole motherfucking narrative, my motherfucking narrative, on what the fuck I know to charge it to the game about one person that you know. The names are going to come out, stupid bitch. Fucking narration was not about fucking JoJo, you stupid bitch. Stupid bitch. You, and, and, and I, I get it. You have to put your shit out like that because you don't know what the fuck I know. And what the fuck I know gives me every fucking right and reason to say, hmm, there's some shocking shit. There's some crazy ass shit. Let me connect the dots on some motherfucking shit. Let me get something straight, bitch. I wouldn't give a fuck if you done suck bone dry Jojo and he done lick every motherfucking juice up out your motherfucking body. Let's get that shit straight. This ain't got a motherfucking thing to do with a fucking nigga, bitch. Get the fuck over it. You get the fuck over it. You wants to run to his defense, which he didn't need a fucking defense because the motherfucking story wasn't about him, bitch. You a stu you a stupid ass bitch. You a stupid, you talking about lonely, lonely bitch. You got to be the most loneliness ass motherfucker that I seen. Let's talk about that. You lonely, lonely bitch if you only fucking knew. And that's your problem with one papoose. You don't fucking know. I'm going to always be that motherfucking mystery in your motherfucking head, whether if you give a fuck or not. Whether if you give a fuck or not, bitch. Let's get that straight. I'm going to tell you one more time, because I know your ass done woke up from my motherfucking life, because that's what you do. The same shit that pretty much all of us do. We sit and we wait for people to come live, and oh my God, we have a story to tell. Bitch. You ain't the only motherfucker clever, bitch. You ain't the only motherfucker. Stand the fuck up, bitch, because like I said, you met your fucking match. If you want to keep going back and forth on some stupid, you're saying sometimes I can make it your motherfucking day and make it some motherfucking time. Simple as that. The same way you do. All you, you, you run your mouth. Blah, 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 blah. All that motherfucking uh, uh, simple-minded ass shit that you want to preach over there. Bitch, you'll be the last motherfucker that I ever fucking trust. No, close to the last motherfuckers out here. When tell your ass a motherfucking thing. The fuck on with that goddamn sweet and sour ass bullshit your ass talk. The fuck on. Stop making it about a motherfucking man, bitch. Because you don't know what the fuck I got going on and what the fuck I do. You have, you have the slightest, I'm going to tell you this, the slightest motherfucking idea. The slightest. So push your little motherfucking buttons, call you a motherfucking Uber, and make your motherfucking day. That's it. It's opportunity and motherfucking air out here. A man, Angie with two motherfucking knees, a.k.a. Catfish, are you out your motherfucking mind? Are you out your motherfucking mind? Bitch, I can teach your ass motherfucking game and how to fucking step. Are you out your motherfucking mind? You gots to be out your motherfucking mind. The story wasn't about him. Stop making it the fuck about him because I might mention a fucking name. Stop it. You look stupid. Stop it. I'm going to tell you again. Stop reaching, bitch. Stop reaching, bitch. If you want to touch what you're reaching for, get in your motherfucking Uber and fly your ass out. That's all you got to do. You can clear all this shit up or whatever the fuck you making your fight about. You want to make your fight about some shit. The same way, bitch, you come out here and talk about these motherfucking stories about what the fuck is going on on, the, on these streets out here, bitch, so can I. And the way that I put it down and the way that I motherfucking said it, that I said it and I said that shit.
and ain't a motherfucking thing you can do about it. You, him, her, them, they, or those, bitch. All of them in that same motherfucking category. However you want to lay this shit down. Bitch, you got, you, like I said, you, you totally got the right motherfucking one. You do. But when I have fucking time for it, right now I got a little bit of time for it. You, your mouth run like a motherfucking foster, bitch. Ain't shit motherfucking gangster about your ass. Nothing. The bitch, the old ass motherfucking picture you put up. We gonna talk about that picture in my motherfucking thumbnail since she wants to keep talking about a motherfucking part. You explain to the motherfuckers out here why you was a couple of inches motherfucking short with a baby motherfucking afro at the age of fucking 30. Bitch, you the one with the fucking hair problem. Not Pap. Pap ain't got a fucking hair problem. A fucking part. Oh, you want me to drop the one where you got motherfucking extensions and braids here sitting over there with that motherfucking Shaka Kong ass 299 wig? Bitch, we can go there. I like your antidotes, though. You watched a lot of TV. You know how to relate your shit to all that motherfucking Scooby-Doo and the Flintstones and, and, and aerospace ass motherfucking shit. The water, the land, you know, all that sea shit. Sea world. You, you, you good at that shit. Shit don't impress me, though. It don't fucking impress me. And I know you're going to tell the people, well, I'm not out here to impress you, motherfuckers. You still a whole bitch. Takes my story. You take it. Bitch, you want to know what the fuck I know? How about you ask? Better yet, don't even ask, because I'm going to feed you a whole bunch of bullshit on that, too. A bunch of bullshit on that. You don't know. What the fuck I, I know. You don't know why the fuck I move the way the fuck I move. Mainly one. I'll give you one reason. Because it's disease ass motherfuckers like you are. You got the same motherfucking disease the rest of these motherfuckers out here have. And I'm going to call you out on your shit in one motherfucking minute. I'm going to call you out on your shit, right? Angie with two motherfucking E's. Fucking catfish, bitch. I'm going to call you out. But... You sit your dumb ass over there, right? E he 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 he. As I'm gonna talk about the nigga Scooby Doo, bitch. You know that nigga motherfucking lying on some type of motherfucking shit. But oh, cause I'm gonna keep the peace motherfucking treaty with this nigga. I ain't gonna call his shit out. E he 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 he. That's what the fuck you do. And you talking about you don't like liars, bitch. You sit up there with one. You sit up there, and I can say that shit now because of the shit I heard him say and the shit I saw him fucking post up there. My name shouldn't be in his motherfucking statistical ass voting registry over there, bitch. I ain't got shit to do with no fucking Scooby-Doo and who posted up no goddamn shit and who said shit about him. If he couldn't take what I said to him about on, on the level of being a defense for him, then that's his motherfucking crooked ass, not mass. Not mass. Stupid ass bitch, you so bit worried about, oh, and, and, that, and that's why I ain't no people here. Let me ask you so you can ask me right back if I give a fuck. Go ahead. Ask yourself that if I give a fuck. All this motherfucking air out here, bitch, I'm out here right now breathing this shit. And when this shit here disappear from me breathing to keep life in my motherfucking body, that's when your motherfucking statement will become relevant to my motherfucking ass. Until then... The fuck is you talk about? Ain't no, ain't no, there's no people. Ask me if I give a fuck. Ask me. Because I'm going to breathe, baby. Only one person can stop that. One. One. You sound stupid, Angie, with two motherfucking knees. There's nothing psychological that you can diagnose me, my pussy, my ass, my mouth, my brain, my heart, my lungs, nothing on. Not a motherfucking thing. You think that you sit down here and uh, the people that you say ain't here or you don't see these people, you don't see them. How do you think they feel these people may feel about you? Huh? You think that you got what? Everybody wrapped around your motherfucking click, bitch? Is that what you think? <laughs> like I said, let's talk about this narcissist shit. Narcissist. Just so that you are aware of it. Because most people, when they far gone in their narcissist motherfucking behavior, when they so far gone, they can't see the shit that they do because they feel like that they have put themselves up on this motherfucking pedestal that can over talk and run that underlay for the overplay ass bullshit on a nigga. That's what you do. Bitch, the same shit that you're implying that every motherfucker has done out here, your motherfucking ass has done it as well. 
I ain't going to post you no motherfucking receipts because I ain't got time for that shit. I ain't got time for that shit. I know when I get off of here, you about over there typing your motherfucking ass off faster than Kermit the motherfucking frog with a fucking biography going on. Bitch, I don't read that shit. Type your ass off. That wasn't about him. It wasn't about him. I said your fucking name. I talk. I talked about you and motherfucking book him. Motherfucking boo as shit. Yes, the fuck I did. But I noticed you couldn't spend no time on that shit. You wanted to spend your whole motherfucking five, ten minutes commentary on some shit about a motherfucking JoJo. Are you out your motherfucking mind? Bitch, Pappas in Wisconsin. And you have no idea what the fuck is going on around me up here in motherfucking Wisconsin, bitch. None. Now, how about that? The shit that I just gave you, yeah, that got come from the Chicago schools. Let you tell, you want to tell out of Chicago schools. That's what you said. I guess you better be mad at Chicago motherfucking schools because every time you twist and turn my motherfucking shit to fit your motherfucking screwed up ass narrative, bitch, this Chicago school motherfucker going to come at your fucking throat. Based on that, not about a man. Take the man out the motherfucking equation. Take it out. Take it out. You won't, you won't smoke. You want to reiterate my shit to make it fit your fucking narrative. Make it about that. Let's, let's make our shit about that. A uh, man, bitches, you that fucking hard up that you got to keep bringing up and twisting it and turning it to make it about that? Nah, bitch, it ain't never about a fucking man. Bitch, I didn't get thus far riding on a fucking man back. Are you fucking crazy? Oh, my bad. Maybe you used to it. According to the picture that you put up in the old motherfucking high school, what you was about, maybe 20-ish up in there, maybe 20-ish, riding on a nigga back. Mm-hmm. On a nigga back. What you used to is probably what you still do. <laughs> the fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. See how you can talk that shit? I can talk it right back, bitch. Right the fuck back. Happy Sunday, y'all. Happy, happy Sunday to everybody. Happy Sunday. That's what you do. Twists and turns. Ugh. I'm so tired of the lies. Then bitch log off and go to fucking church. Push a wheelchair nigga to church with you. How about that? Take all your niggas to church with you. Go do that shit. Ugh. I just can't stand a motherfucker. Here's let me let me enlighten you on some shit about what you can't stand. All these motherfuckers. Do you realize that ain't a motherfucker out here living for you? You do know that, right? Ain't a motherfucker out here living for you. How the fuck are you so tired about the motherfuckers lying? How the fuck does that even get on your fucking nerves? How the fuck are you stressed to the limit to be over there every motherfucker time you click that button? It's a motherfucker tired. Bitch, you tired of your motherfucking self and your mouth running like a motherfucking water faucet. That's what the fuck you tired of. You don't know none of these motherfuckers, as you say, to be so fucking tired. These motherfuckers can talk all motherfucking day till they head turn blue. I ain't tired of shit. Because they don't live for me, and I don't live for them. Talk reality about some shit, Mr. Bitch-Ass Attorney, Psychologic Major, and, 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 and Pussy Therapy, and Dick Therapist. You do that shit. You do that shit. You match your motherfucking match. You think Pap gonna ever stand the fuck down on your mouth running ass? Bitch, please. Bitch, please. Or how you tell your people, you got me fucked up. You got you 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 want to be over there and typing and typing and typing and typing and typing away, bitch. Find it. Don't go unuse some delicate information, some important information that can be useful to you. Other than that, you will be wasting your motherfucking time looking my shit up. It's data, bitch. And when I take time to come out to look some shit up, to do some shit pertaining to some shit that I need to be done, I'm going to conclude what the fuck I looked up. You look me up. You have the address. You calling out my motherfucking baby. That's my baby daddy. Fucking name. What, fuck? what the fuck I ask you again is you going to do about Walter Mitchell, bitch? What the fuck is you going to do about it? But you spent time to look it up, to come on the screen, to tell a motherfucker that I know where you're at. I can get this. I can do that. 
<laughs> I'm gonna pull your motherfucking Trump card, bitch, and tell you to use it. Use that bitch today. Use it today. Don't just look it up. Put some use to that shit. Then you will become a little bit more uh, 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 um, active in what you say instead of running your motherfucking mouth. I ain't looking you up. I don't give a fuck if you stayed in a motherfucking whale, bitch. It's to that level with us. Because all you want to do is keep coming out here and change up my fucking narrative of my fucking story. You don't know what the fuck I know. You don't know how I sat out here, me, not you, bitch, and was able, and I put together my own motherfucking dots on a lot of people, including your motherfucking ass. You worthless, you petty, you scroungy, you a catfish, you a whole motherfucking bitch, period. You not my motherfucking kind. You not my kind. Saucing motherfuckers up. What you waiting on? Bitches to call you to tell you they whole motherfucking life story so you can fix it? Bitch, when you out here running your mouth thoroughly on motherfucking YouTube? The fuck out of here, bitch. Do what you do best. Keep soliciting to help take care of drunken Larry and motherfuck Janine. Do that shit, bitch. You do it. You need to solicit your motherfucking self. Maybe then you can actually get the motherfucking divorce and separate like you motherfucking plan on doing. How about I do that? Get the help from the motherfucking people. Raise motherfucking money for that money that nigga need over there to pay off the fucking whatever your part of the fucking loan. No, you got your simple ass out here trying to raise money for another motherfucker when you the motherfucker over in your fucking home need motherfucking help. Explain that shit, bitch. Huh? Make it make motherfucking sense. You want to clown? Bitch, I can clown. All motherfucking day. All motherfucking day. But the spirit don't feel good, but right now it do, bitch. Oh, yeah. Feels real good. Oh, man. You need to sit your simple ass down if you ever think that this is about a man when I'm walking my ass around here with motherfucking tits and ass and a pussy. Bitch, a man. Come a damn a motherfucking dozen. This ain't never been about a motherfucking JoJo. Ever. So don't get that shit twisted. Don't get that shit twisted. Nah, don't, don't do that. You look disgusting doing it. Thirsty, too. You thirsty bitch. You thirsty bitch. There ain't nothing that I want to know about you. Why well, ain't fit in when you infiltrate what? You got to steal from a bitch to do that to the bitch. Bitch, do you understand that there are so many ways of defining infiltration? Do you understand that? Do you understand that? The smart one, the golden one. Matter of fact, you do look a little bit like that golden child on that thumbnail I put up. Bitch, and it ain't going nowhere. Till you explain why the fuck you in your fucking 30s with a two-inch baby fro. How about doing that? You worried about a fucking part when you sitting over there got to put some motherfucking uh, Afro sheen in your shit? Bitch, stop. Stop. You ain't all of that, Angie with two motherfucking E's catfish. You ain't all of that, baby. Now, you, 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 and, and with me looking at you and hearing your ass, bitch, you, 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 10 bags away from a bag of salt and sour ass motherfucking chips. Huh? Huh? I can do the same shit that everybody else out here does. But there's some choices that one must make in their fucking lifestyle to not do this shit. Today just so happened to be your motherfucking lucky day. Leave my stories alone. Leave them, leave them alone. Stop switching them up. Stop switching them up. You don't know what the fuck I know that makes me talk about the things that I choose to talk about. There is times where I leave the people in the comment area a little puzzled because my mouth don't run as loose as yours. So there's a lot of fucking details, bitch. A whole lot of them. You have no idea about none. I know your nose ass want to know. But you won't know, and neither will a whole lot of people out here, because like I said, some things are meant to be just put in the fucking wormhole and let that shit go. 
But a lot of things that I learned and I didn't listen, baby, they done educated me about all the motherfucking fucktards out here. All of the motherfucking fucktards. And the craziest thing about it is you're in the fucktard category. Imagine that. Imagine that. Imagine that, bitch. You got a whole motherfucking liar sitting up on your damn channel talking about some, I don't fuck with liars, I don't do this for liars. Bitch, get off his dick. Stop sucking his fucking nuts. Trying to hold on, what, to your little friendship like that. Why? Because you know how that nigga can get down too? Because you know he dirty, dirty too? You know, keep them dirty motherfuckers close, ain't you? You don't want that smoke like I'm going to stay cool with this nigga. I know this nigga lying. And then you sit your motherfucking ass up there. A deep bow. A deep bow. You are aware when you say that, bitch, you know that nigga is on some bullshit. So cut the shit. A deep bow. A deep bow. Sound like a fucking moron. The fuck out of here. The fuck out of here, bitch. And you're still a bitch. You a bitch when you left my channel. And you still a whole fucking bitch episodes motherfucking later. And you're going to be a bitch when I get ready to the end this motherfucking shit. How about that? How about that, bitch? You think your voice, your vocabulary, your stance intimidate a motherfucker? You got the right motherfucking cereal today, bitch. What you want? Captain Crunch? Tricks? What? Apple Jacks, bitch? Pick your motherfucking flavor. Pick it. I'll have it. Pick it. Pick it. Everybody do the exact same shit out here. But, oh, if you said it, if you make it, if you do it, your shit is the right shit. Your shit is the way it's supposed to go. Now, if that ain't a motherfucking narcissist, then I don't know what is. Because that's some goofy shit that you done told yourself. But since you brought your little itty-bitty problem out here to the YouTube streets about your nigga over there in the wheelchair, allegedly, <laughs> got to wait until you get the money and all that shit because he don't have it and he got to get... All that shit, you know, I ain't gonna put, I ain't gonna quote you directly. All that shit, right, bitch, sound like you got a problem. You can't even get to the nigga dick that you wanna ride. You got to watch another nigga dick that don't rise. Now, ain't that a compromising motherfucking situation to be in? Get your shit in order, bitch. Get your shit in order. Huh? You got the wiggle tickle, your motherfucking shit wet with phone calls and emails and shit, bitch. Cause what? Your the other crippled motherfucking nigga can't make a fucking move. Imagine that compromised motherfucking life. But yet then you have the whole motherfucking energy to go help another motherfucking family. And your shit fucked up. <laughs> Bitch, I'm like, MC Hammer, bitch, you can't touch this. You can't touch this, warm face looking ass bitch. You can't touch this. I know, I know. You're going to watch some TV today before you hit me back so you can get all your little antidotes together off of the motherfucking TV ass shit. I'm going to let you win in that motherfucking area, bitch, because I don't watch TV like that. None of it. I don't watch none of that shit like that. Yo ass can quote every motherfucking 1970 fucking cartoon bullshit, every fucking goddamn uh, Days of Our Lives, all that motherfucking basketball wives shit, all this guy, you, you can quote even what the fuck they doing in the fucking stock market, bitch. You, you, just, you, don't, you ain't got no job. You just been glued to that motherfucking TV and in and, and, and your younger years, glued to the motherfucking basketball gym with your skirt on so that nigga can finger fuck your ass up in that bitch. How about that, bitch? How about that? How about that? I'm the smart, I'm the this, oh, and these people, and oh, Lord, and these people, that, and these people that, what about you, bitch? When you gonna talk about your shit? What, wait, wait, where do you think that your flaws at, bitch? Because you got them. Everybody got them. 
Everybody got them. Let people let you tell it. I got one. Ooh, who's that part down your head? Bitch, you got a two inch afro. So, and what's gonna happen about that? What's gonna happen about that? You got short, you short ass hair with fucking wigs and a fucking rat tail wrapped around your stretched out ass fucking ponytail with no motherfucking edges. How about that? But what am I going to do with that? How would that benefit me? Why? why, why, why? Nothing. Nothing. But kind of feels good the same way your ass do this lame ass bullshit. You. You focused on fucking hair. Bitch, out of all things that you could be focusing on, you talking about being smart or whatever. Bitch, talk about how the fuck I get up and go get this shit. Talk about how the fuck... I'm doing in my life at my fucking age. Talk about how the fuck I ain't wanting for a motherfucking thing. Talk about how I have the best, uh, the most wonderful motherfucking parents in the world. That you, you, you can't talk about no good shit, huh? A part, a part, bitch. I got a part up top and a part down bottom that works very motherfucking well for me when I choose to make it do what it fucking do. But that. With no hesitations, bitch. You the one over there with a minor block in your motherfucking road to, to travel on to make your life a little bit better. Bitch, mine's better. It can't do nothing but get greater. Are you fucking kidding me? Ain't no motherfucking restrictions on my shit. None. Just like that. I move when the fuck I want to. Say what the fuck I want to. Do what the fuck I want to. That's it. I'm not no yes man. Yes, baby. Yes, baby. The fuck out of here, simple ass bitch. Because you ain't got shit. Bow down, bitch. You ain't got shit. Not a motherfucking thing. It's, it's, it's all you scream. Every time you come on here, that's all you got? That's all you got? Well, damn, at least you found my baby daddy. Ain't you going to put me with that motherfucker? I'm the one got a baby by him. Ain't you, ain't you going to yell out his motherfucking name? Huh? You going to do that? You know he motherfucking exists. You looked him up. You looked him up. And you still ain't used that shit. Ain't you going to come and tell Walter Mitchell some shit all about me, bitch? Ain't you going to do that? And see how that work out for you. See how that works out for you. <laughs> you gonna look up a motherfucker that I motherfucker know and do what with it? And do what with it? Huh? He gonna side with you? <laughs> you gonna tell him that I'm a crazy nut ass motherfucker? <laughs> he, he know that shit too, motherfucker. He know that shit too. He know that shit. Daddy ain't raised no punk. Not a punk bitch. Nah. Daddy ain't raised a punk bitch. But you continue to talk what you talk on what you think you know and keep switching up the motherfucking narratives about it. I said, hmm, well, this is a shocker. And if I said this is a shocker, bitch, it's something that you don't fucking know. Clearly was an unexpectancy. Bitch, infiltrate? I know exactly what the fuck I mean by infiltration. It doesn't mean that somebody brought me something or came here to take something the fuck away. Came by meaning that who the fuck is fucking dirty. That did not have good heart, good fucking intentions. Stupid, simple-minded bitch. That's what the fuck I meant and that's what the fuck I said. I'm saying it now to you. No good heart. No good intentions. And that was very easy to sum up, bitch. Use your brain. All you have to do is go back a couple of episodes somewhere around on motherfucking YouTube. You'll see it clear as motherfucking day. What, I was supposed to just sit like a motherfucking potato and fucking rot? Are you fucking kidding me? The same way your motherfucking mouth can put your shit out here about how you feel or what the fuck you see or what the fuck you heard. Bitch, so can I. No limit motherfucking soldier, bitch. That's what the fuck I am. A no limit motherfucking soldier. You ain't got to recognize it from these screens or nothing. 
you can catch a motherfucking flight since you look my shit up and you got that shit on speed dial locked up there in your motherfucking bookmarks. And you can come and find out about the no limit motherfucking soldier that I am. You can do that. You can do that. Tell your nigga you will be right back. Get you a round trip ticket so you can surprise your motherfucking ass on how low you think that my life is. And I'm going to surprise you on how motherfucking low I can fucking go. I can tell you that. Don't twist that age up. A lot of people do. A lot of people do. Oh, you know, she old, she this. Age, in Aaliyah's words, ain't nothing but a motherfucking number. It's where that fire at, bitch. It's where that fire at. And I can tell you now, Papu's got more fire than 180 motherfucking degrees fucking oven. I can tell you that. I'm going to tell you that, and I'm going to make you a motherfucking promise on that shit. That's a motherfucking promise. I say what I mean. I mean what the fuck I say. And when I end this motherfucking live, you best to trust what the fuck I say. Now, you can push a button. You can send a Fed. You can send a CSI, the, 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 the district motherfucking police here, bitch, and watch the motherfucking clout that I motherfucking have with these motherfuckers. Go ahead. Make my motherfucking day. And that's not a threat. It's a whole, I'm going to say it slowly for you, motherfucking promise. This ain't about a man, bitch. This ain't about a man. I could put you one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, 13, 14, 15, per, probably up to maybe a hundred of them niggas on this motherfucking screen. All you got to do is identify one. I'll give you that. I'll let you identify one. Just one of them niggas. One. And only with one of those niggas is a snap of a motherfucking finger, bitch. It's just a snap. It's just a snap. He don't, he don't even motherfucking talk. He just snap his motherfucking finger. Bitch, and the job's done. Simple as that. You don't know my world. Angie with two motherfucking knees in the cactus. You don't know where the fuck I come from and what the fuck I did and who the fuck I know. Sit the fuck down, bitch. You're not the only one with the mouth. You're not the only one that can do all of that. Oh, and I wish a bitch would. And I did this and I did that. Your ass is just as old as dirt, just like the fuck I am. So I guess we're going to be two dirty ass motherfuckers fighting of a non-reason ass fucking situation. When you find one, you holler at me. Because right now we're going to have to make this a non-reason ass motherfucking beef. How about that? How about that? Which makes not only you look like an idiot, it also makes myself look like an idiot. Two motherfucking idiots. Because one wants to be louder than the other and dictate what the fuck you think you know about what the fuck I say. And then the other, myself, retaliating because I want to against your alligator mouth looking rat tail, fake hair ass, wearing parted hair, braided ass bitch. That's why. Let's make it about that. Maybe you will get this commentary right. Maybe you'll go write your whole motherfucking biography correctly this time. Put your association, affiliation, words all together. Go ahead. Go do that shit. Now you a whole motherfucking psych major. Twisted brain ass bitch. Pick your motherfucking struggle. Pick your struggle. Pick your struggle. What? Being an attorney wasn't selling good enough for you? Huh? That wasn't good enough for you? Oh, because I didn't come out and practice my psych major out here in public to, to, to do what? To do what? Psych people, brains and shit, grown ass motherfuckers. One thing about PAP, I do know eight hours of work is worth eight hours of pay, bitch. And ain't nobody paying nothing for that type of motherfucking education, especially on shit that they already know. Everybody out here has common sense, but let you tell it, or don't the motherfucker out here use common sense, it's YouTube. 
Motherfuckers can be like the army, bitch, all they want to be. Be all you want to be. Be who the fuck you want to be. Say what the fuck you want to say. Act how the fuck you want to act and move when the fucking wind blows. Period. Period. All that goddamn synopsis ass bullshit your ass speak over there. Bitch, you will put me to sleep. If you was next door, bitch, I'd be walking the fuck away from you with all that riddle Ralph ass shit. I wouldn't hear that shit, but you, you like hearing that shit. You, only you. It sounds good to you. You. You watch too much TV. Basic ass shit at that. Basic ass shit. So you can align your motherfucking kindergarten ass motherfucking jokes up with your shit. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Your whole spaceship ass motherfucker. Out of space ass bitch. So what the fuck you are. But you met your match. I'll keep telling you that. I'm quiet for the most part. Quiet. But this is my channel. And if there's whatever situations, if there's comedy, if whatever's going on, I could talk about whatever the fuck I want to talk about. You just have to learn, practice, condition yourself on how not to let it rub your motherfucking skin. So you don't have to keep coming out here barking some irrelevant ass bullshit to make yourself feel good. But you ended up with, Whoa, I just can't do this. Woo, these people, no common sense. You the, you the only one. You're the only motherfucker out here with common sense. You're the only bright ass motherfucker out here. Who, who, who told you that shit? Who told you that shit? Who told you that? You sound like a whole motherfucking priest luring the people in on your fucking bullshit. You one of my motherfucking reasons exactly why if you was a motherfucking pastor, I would not be at your motherfucking church. Nobody want to hear all that shit. Nobody want to hear that but you. Now, with that being said, again, you can kiss my motherfucking ass. Or you can use the data that you use to pull up my information and come holler at your girl. You can do that. Opportunity in air. Don't take that long from Florida over here up to Wisconsin. Bitch, I'm in Wisconsin. I ain't shit to hide about that. Not a motherfucking thing. I'm not the one with the problem with where I stay. You gonna have the motherfucking problem coming to somewhere where you don't stay. That's the shit you got to figure out. Should I use it? Should I don't? Should I go? Should I stay? What should I do? What should I do? Choices, huh, bitch? Choices. Make the choices. Decide. Hurry up and decide now, bitch. Don't come on Christmas because I ain't got your ass a motherfucking gift. Don't do that shit. Don't do that shit. My home is very welcoming. Very welcoming. You bring the right attitude. Come with the right attitude. The doors are open. Come all fucked up, bitch. You're going to have to wonder how the fuck you're going to get up out of here. Simple as that. You make that choice. I gave you the fucking option. Motor mouth. Alligator mouth. Ball head, bitch. You want to talk about hair. I'm going to leave your thumbnail up. I'm going to have fun with that, bitch. I ain't done either. Matter of fact, I think I'm going to go post some more of your shit up and so everybody can see from way back then in 2019 who all was associated with who before all this motherfucking riffraff had even started. How about that? See, it's a lot. A lot of people don't know, including myself, that I didn't know. But I had to sit down and figure this shit out because it will help you on who the fuck to stay away from, on who the fuck to stop picking up a phone or answering a fucking email to. As that old boy say, that hoe ain't loyal. That hoe ain't loyal. I'm going to tell y'all again. That hoe ain't motherfucking loyal. Period. Period. You ain't fucking loyal, bitch. Not at all. Not on my motherfucking watch. You come out here and portray all the fuck you want to do. Be this. Laugh. Smile. All this shit. Bitch, you are crooked. You phony. And you a whole fucking catfish. <laughs> You a whole motherfucking catfish. Let me do these dishes before I go. I don't use dishwasher. Probably, let me show you that too before you be like, oh, this 
bitch here and washing them motherfucking dishes. Washing them motherfucking dishes just in case your motherfucking ass got something to say about that bitch. A whole motherfucking dishwasher. How about that, bitch? How about that? I'll show you some simple ass shit, bitch. How about that? One thing I noticed that you won't fucking take your mouth and your time to do so is call a bitch broke. Nah. You spent plenty of time talking about bitch got two motherfucking cheap ass kids and bitch your ass is riding on a passenger side. You on the passenger side. How the fuck are you gonna talk? How the fuck are you gonna talk? Huh? Chicago schools. In a picture that you took, that gym just looked as dusty as motherfucking Chicago. Wasn't nothing spectacular about that bitch, but you hugging up with another nigga. You just kept niggas all your motherfucking life to make your way, huh? How you gonna pay your rent? A nigga. All my money spent? A nigga. Tell you what you ought to do? Get a nigga. <laughs> Tell you what you ought to do? Get a nigga. A nigga can work it out if you let him catfish. A nigga can work it out. That problem that you have, you just can't seem to solve. Keep praying and keep praying. That nigga in your house could get alone in someday. How about that? How about that? Papa ain't got no problem. None, 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 bitch. None. Everything you see, everything I fucking show you, I own this bitch. And ain't a nigga did shit. Not a motherfucking thing. Nothing. I did what I was supposed to do in life, bitch. I got three kids. Three kids out of what we call is, is worthy. That motherfucking dick down there. After that, some of these whole ass niggas ain't shit. Period. I'm not no motherfucking housewife, bitch. I'm not here to cook, clean, and change a motherfucking diaper. That's your motherfucking category. Beyonce fucked half of this motherfucking bitches up out here. Cater to you. Cater my motherfucking ass. We gonna cater to each other. But you a whole cater to you ass, bitch. Let me cater to you. Nah, not pap. Not pap. I mean, since you wanna do the man shit, let me tell you this. A lot of them do become intimidated by me. A lot of them hate that, oh, you know, she don't need me. Let me do this. Let me go here. Let me go there because a nigga wants you to need them. They want you to need them. And you fit that motherfucking category. You a whole needy ass fucking bitch. You are. You. Give a fuck about none of that shit you say. None of it. None. And you're not the boss of anything to tell anybody how and when to do their motherfucking commentary. Commentary is a story. Commentary is a story. And everybody out here got a fucking story to tell. But because it don't sit well with your wet, wet motherfucking ass, it's a problem. Well, if it's a problem, then that's something that you have to deal with. Not nobody else. You don't have a beat for Pap to dance to. Not one motherfucking beat, and I don't care if you bought the most expensive motherfucking drum set out there. The whole motherfucking drum set, I'm gonna do one of you. Bitch, this ain't drum line, motherfucker. See how you do that shit? See how you do that shit when you watch all that TV shit? This ain't drum line, bitch. Your quotations has come all off of motherfucking TV ass bullshit. So dumb ass damn. Dummy, dummy, you only connect to motherfucking crazy ass people, or crooked ass people, fraud ass people, non loyal ass people. <coughs> you do. That's your connection. You may not see them over here because you don't see the disloyal. You don't see the, the, the crazy ass people. You don't see it. You don't see it. That's why. They not over here. Because I don't connect to them. Each category of people connects to each other. You get it. Birds of a feather will flock together. Why you think you have all of those types oh, with your ass? They're pretty much like you. Pretty much like you. 
I'm simple. I'm clean. I'm honest. And I'm definitely fucking loyal. Especially to the fucking game. Are you mad at me? Because I won't put all the fucking details and shit out there? Of what the fuck I know that makes, that, that, that allows me to say what it is that I choose to say? How you mad about that? How you mad about that? When you sit your loud mouth ass over there and reiterate a whole bunch of shit. Whole bunch of shit. And for the record, and I'm going to say it because I don't give a fuck about this shit no more. Does it look right for uh, 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 the, the neutral or whatever the fuck you are that solicitates for a fucking drunken Larry and his fucking wife and your matchmaker who was uh, solely Team Kales? You answer that. Because if I have to look at it, it's no difference from motherfucking book. I'm going down eating snake with a motherfucking steak. How about that? How about that? How about that? And if I was the fucking man, ain't no motherfucking way you gonna have association with a motherfucking crucifier. But I'm rocking Team Kales. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You make it make sense. And I know you'll come back, bitch. I ain't on nobody team. I can do that. I can do that. It's not about you. It's about the soulmate of it. Now I'm talking about it. Now I am. It's about the soulmate. Everybody that I know, mouths pretty much dropped. Like, what the fuck? Hold up. I, you, 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 you do know she fucking with Drunken Larry and, 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 and the wife, right? You, you, you do know she reading off the shit from Drunken Larry, right? Against Mr. Kelly or telling his story about how the shit was. Huh? Huh, bitch? Your word. Huh? Huh? Who, where they do that shit at? Where they do that shit at? You gonna sit here and tell me what? What the fuck? I don't make sense. I don't make sense, bitch. That's a whole motherfucking double dabbing, double dipping, double standard ass fucking bullshit. The fuck out of here, huh? The fuck out of here, bitch. You 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 got you got words. You got contact. You have affiliation with this fucking nigga. And the soulmate, okay? Are you fucking kidding me? When everybody is portrayed, everybody's sitting here looking and hearing all the shit about, oh, I'm you, Team Kales, Team Kales. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. Fuck they do that shit at. Now I'm talking about this shit. Now I am. Fuck they do that shit at. The same way motherfucking book them fucking neck got chopped the fuck off for eating snakes with the steak, bitch. That shit should have been chopped short. That shit should have been whacked. But nobody speaks on that shit. Fuck you mean. Fuck you mean. You just did it in the video you just got off of. But don't forget to hit the uh, Janine and cash out. We need to help her out. Last I checked, Janine is Drunken Larry's wife. Meaning, let me break it down for you. Meaning that... You have some type of affiliation with those damn people. The one that came out to crucify Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly. But then you have a team members, members, put an S on it, that sits beside you. Sits beside you. That's a team chaos. The fuck out of here. What was good for the gander for that motherfucking book him over there? Who ate snake? Who ate that fucking steak down there with that same nigga? It applies to your motherfucking ass. Period. To be honest, and that's why I don't rock with your motherfucking ass. That's why I can't stand your motherfucking ass, bitch. You shouldn't have no motherfucking goddamn mouth to speak on any motherfucking thing about Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly if I had my motherfucking way. But I get it. You want to play the playing field out here. I'm going to stay neutral with the shit. They can't figure this shit out because I'm the smartest bitch out here. Long as I sit neutral, nobody will figure out what the fuck I'm doing. Maybe 
You didn't got enough juice of what you all need to do by playing both sides of the fucking field, bitch. Both sides. You don't know if you wanted the motherfucking touchdown or intercept, bitch. You don't know. You straddle the fucking fence out here for a long motherfucking time. For a long fucking time. And the word on the curb out here, you doing any type of motherfucking affiliation with this motherfucking nigga over here who crucified this motherfucking man? Bitch, you were selling and sold and, and sowing all motherfucking seeds to that nigga. That's what I think. And that's what I'm going to say. And that ain't my motherfucking al allegedly. That's what the fuck I believe. That's what the fuck I believe. But because you can come out here and laugh this shit out, become beasties, best of friends, BFFs, soul motherfucking mates, got the motherfucking intellectual answer to psychological motherfucking issues. You the shit. No, bitch, you a straddler. You a motherfucking straddler. And I knew then when you start the way you was talking, when I, pe bitch, you fucking with them niggas? Hell motherfucking no, bitch. And I'm pretty damn sure because my gut telling me so. You done sold information. You done told motherfucking information. You correlinking that nigga back on information of what you so kindly getting from other motherfuckers. The fuck out of here. You know why? Because it's a natural instinct to kind of do, especially when you straddling the motherfucking fence. How much he paid you, bitch? How much he paid you to do your dirty motherfucking work? Huh? Because you need the money so that your other home motherfucking dick can sell, so can buy you out, bitch. You need money. You need money. Throw some cash on that hoe. Throw some cash on that hoe. And then throw them D's on that bitch. The fuck? The fuck? Get down. Get down, Angie, with two E's. Bitch, I love to get down when I have to. Nasty motherfucking dirty game, though. My heart ain't like that, bitch. My heart ain't like that. A good, pure heart. Use the data. Come on, fly out. Where the fuck you look me up at? Come on. Get, bring your coat and boots and shit, though. About snow in this bitch over here. And I'm going to welcome your ass in. What you eat? Ham hocks? Skin, 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 whatever that fucking shit is? Uh, the skins and shit, you eat all that shit? I got you. Hospitality is great. I have great hospitality. I do. I do. But you ain't on that slick shit. You ran that shit on all them other motherfuckers out there. Pat one touching you with a fine tooth motherfucking comb when you opened your mouth. I got a letter to read from Drunken Lad. Mighty funny you ain't get one to read for Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly, though. Imagine that shit. But you got one from Drunk Larry to read. <laughs> you already sold your motherfucking ass for team, for team, what, 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 well, what the fuck is it for COVID over there? You ride with them motherfucking niggas. I know you finna come back and bark. I don't ride for bitch. You don't know Cause that's your underlay for the motherfucking overplay, bitch. It is. You touched it, you in it. Simple as that. And that's how the motherfucking street game go. Bitch, you can't take a motherfucking vice lord and send him over to the disciple neighborhood. He go over there, he fucking touched it, he in fucking violation. Period. Period, bitch. Ain't no motherfucking straddle. Ain't no motherfucker going to shake no motherfucking hand. You jumped in over here. You got jumped in in this motherfucking side. Fuck is you over there for? And you did that shit. You did that shit. You did. I'm going to read the read the letters now for, I'm going to read the letters now for Drunken Larry. And the crazy thing about it, Bitch, you came over to read the fucking letters, the letters to motherfucking Team Kale side. You were on your motherfucking shit with damn near 50, 60 percent of motherfucking Kelly people up in there. Supporters, reading that shit to them. Brightest, the fuck, the fuck was everybody motherfucking twisted? 
the fuck did they want to hear a letter about Drunken Larry's motherfucking confession on some fucking shit? The motherfucker that sent that man up that fucking river on the fucking cross. Are you fucking kidding me? But now, nah, y'all about to cool with that shit. Cool with it. That's where you see where your lawyer people at and your unlawyer people at. Your people with dignity. Your smart motherfucking people. Ain't too many of them. Because ain't no motherfucking way in the hell out of touch. Not nail motherfucking thing to come click and sit and do any motherfucking thing by that bitch. Nothing. That was a rap. That was a rap. That was a rap. You ate, everybody out here ate book a motherfucking ass up, including me. And I still ain't touched nothing about that nigga over there. Not a motherfucking thing. Ain't coming. I rock Team Kells. I know where my stance was. And you can't tell me that that shit is okay with motherfuckers that sit out here and say that they rock Team motherfucking Kells and sitting up there listening to a whole motherfucking bitch that gets down with Drunken Larry and soliciting money for his goddamn wife. The fuck out of here and got problems in her own motherfucking home. Got a dick, don't work, need another dick. And can't do it right now. Bitch, you so motherfucking good and you got all of that. Bitch, you'd have been made your mother. You make your motherfucking move. Pack your shit up. Let that motherfucking cripple ass nigga in that motherfucking home have that shit. Restart your life. See, because Pat can do that. Had I been in a situation like yours, compromised bitch, I think I'd have gave a fuck about some material ass motherfucking shit. Bitch, I'd have caught flight and bought my own motherfucking house the next motherfucking day. Matter of fact, I'd have been moving in that bitch. But you got to wait. You got to wait. <laughs> and got nerves to be out here talking about another motherfucking bitch and your whole motherfucking life over there compromised, bitch. Not mine. Not mine. Nah, my man. Mm -mm. Them little two cheap ass cars you got, bitch, and every bit of fifty-five, sixty thousand dollars was paid off by one papoose, bitch. By me, bitch. Both of them bitches. Both of them. And could you imagine, bitch, that the other, the vid, the car that you like to talk about, the car, bitch. Bitch, that bitch is old as dirt and only sitting with 30 motherfucking thousand miles on it, bitch. What? What? If I choose to sell that bitch, it's going to be pretty much close to what the fuck I want to get out of it. That bitch still sitting out there brand motherfucking new. Brand motherfucking new. Old in the year, but brand motherfucking new in the motor, bitch. The fuck is you working with? Huh? Huh, bitch? Huh? This motherfucking home is a 15 motherfucking year be done in 10, bitch. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Bitch, I could pay this bitch off tomorrow with a push of a fucking button called withdrawal, bitch. I could pay this bitch off tomorrow if I choose to do so. You don't know me. You don't know me. So stop. Stop trying. Stop trying to make somebody look all like you want them to look about one papoose. The only way to know about one papoose is to be that person and come and get inside my world. Your whole motherfucking mind will change up, bitch, quick than a motherfucker. Bitch, I could be that bitch to help your motherfucking ass move immediately if you're thirsty for the dick. I can get you there. Bitch, I can fly your first motherfucking class. Have you in your fucking home. I can help solve your motherfucking compromised motherfucking shit. Because that's the type of motherfucking G I am. But you, bitch, I'm having a pleasure watching your ass drown in your compromised fucking story, bitch. <laughs> How about that? How about that? So you don't know me. And a lot of people... I'm probably angry because they didn't get to know me like they wanted to. And that comes from being a thinker. I have claustrophobia. I've never been on a bus, bitch. I can't stand to be close to people. And not after the world took a major turn, especially in 2000. Some crazy nut ass motherfuckers out here. I have never been in a cab, bitch. I was born in the fucking car, to be in a fucking car. I was born and raised 
to trust some, but not many. You feel what I'm saying? I was raised and educated on how people can be. So you have to see to yourself first. Be yourself first. Learn yourself first. Decide what you can offer, not what you can take all the time. That's, that's me. That's me. I'm a giver. But I won't let you use me. But I'm a giver. So if you need some help with your situation, when you change up your motherfucking attitude and your persona or whatever, I might let you holler at me. I might help dig your ass out the hole so you can get out of the pressure that you in. The struggling of two motherfucking dicks. One rise, one don't. Now you the one with the motherfucking struggle. You are. Not me. Ooh, these motherfuckers is crazy. Bitch, what the fuck you think you are? You, you, you don't think that you didn't have your dosage of the crazy motherfucking water? Because, bitch, as soon as they dropped all the motherfucking flavors out here, you didn't sip you one of them, too. And it pretty much done fucked up the whole goddamn society. I'm not that motherfucker over here struggling about whether if racism and, and the economic system is the way the fuck it is. I've learned my space. I've learned my lane in life. Their way, I don't see a struggle. I don't have a struggle. I learned about the shit. I left the shit. The people on the YouTube streets ain't fixing the shit. Ain't not nail none of these motherfuckers out here who preach all of this shit is nowhere in motherfucking office changing a goddamn thing. It ain't gonna change on no fucking YouTube. Even my motherfucking dog know that shit because he sit here and listen to it with me. And all he do is bark kind of sounds similar to your motherfucking ass to where I have to tell him to shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Shut the fuck up. There's nothing that you would know. You can pull it up. Pull it up, bitch. I might owe a motherfucking medical bill back in 19 motherfucking 89 that I still ain't paying that bitch. I still got a motherfucking bill on that fucking baseboard up there where they said I made a motherfucking turn and the camera caught my motherfucking car and I'm sitting at the fucking red light. Yes, the head of my car was turned into the intersection, but the whole body didn't go through it. Bitch, that $200 motherfucking bill is going to sit till it motherfucking rot up there on that fucking board. Like I said, because I get to make the choices in my fucking life and what I can do. And I know exactly what the fuck can harm me and what the fuck can't. How about that? How about that, bitch? How about that? Since you want to tell something. Let me give your ass something else to tell, bitch. Let me give your ass something else. Tell the people that Papoose just gave you an opportunity to use the data that you're using to pull up my shit to come and visit. That's it. That's all. That's it. That's all. I let you know if a family union or something pop up over there in Florida. I done been to two of them, bitch. All out on the motherfucking water and every goddamn thing. I can let you know when I'm there. I can let, I can do that. I don't have a problem. But you gangster five. And who and I beat up, you ain't going to do a motherfucking thing. Nothing. Nobody wants to sit in jail. Nobody wants to get shot. Nobody wants to get cut. Nobody wants to be ran over with the vehicle or none of that shit. That shit only happens when a person asks for it, when you invite it in. Yeah. And if you choose to take advantage of any one of those situations or any one of those uh, proposals that I just gave to you, then by all means, then do so. Then do so. Use a rat mouth running as faucet water having as ball headed ass fucking bitch. And you're no fucking good. In my book, you touch the dirt over there. I'm only out here rocking for R. Kelly. Not nail another motherfucker. I don't have one motherfucking pump on in sight for another motherfucker out here. Mr. Kelly. My pump arms is to laugh at all of the fucking crazy, funny-ass, fucked-up-ass stories amongst each other's 
on this fucking YouTube. And that's it and that's all. But if you want to make it out a little bit more, because that ain't enough for you of what I'm doing, then all you got to do is reach, bitch. That's it. Reach. Reach for it. A lot of people that keep reaching, you usually will succeed. Keep reaching, bitch. Keep reaching. Keep reaching. My commentary wasn't about him. You have to understand. And I get it that you can't understand because I'm a little motherfucking complex with the fuck I say. And I understand that I'm complex. I understand that. I know that I may speak a language or I may use a different fucking word that don't supposed to be there. Kind of like the shit that you do and a lot of other motherfuckers do. I just do it in such a genuine, different type of way. To, I don't even understand the shit. So I'm half the motherfucker tag. But I know what I'm saying and I know what my thoughts are. I know why I, I chose to move this way. I know why I chose to stay lonely, as you say, in, 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 on this side of the track. See, I know that. And it's because of bitches and a niggas that's out here on these YouTube streets with the things that they say and how they move and what they do. There's no fucking way. And on Team Kells, Team Kells people, because they want to hear what you got to say because they want to lollygag with you, bitch, you touched. You have association with the motherfucking enemy that helped took down Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly, sending paperwork and all that shit. Bitch, you get no motherfucking goddamn respect. From over here, I rock Team Kills. Ain't a fucking letter you can do. Ain't a motherfucking soliciting of a cash app or anything to help that nigga's wife or none of that motherfucking shit. And, and top it off, I don't fuck with people who ain't even helping their motherfucking selves before you go help another motherfucker. Why you think there's so many out here like that? You, 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 you did. You did. Work on your motherfucking problem. Get your shit right. Then you can go help another motherfucker. Can't do shit. You got a whole motherfucker goddamn the shit going on over there in your motherfucking house. Fix that shit first. Do that. Fix that shit first. Fucked up ass bitch. You fucked up. You all the way fucked up. I always want to talk about what somebody else may be doing in their life or what they got and ooh, they crazy and ooh, and, and the psychological uh, uh, did, did this and, and, and let me let me analyze this bitch and woo, who I'm so tired of this shit, ooh, and the common sense, ooh, and the narcissist of these people. Bitch, you just described every bit of you as well. Of you as well. You did that shit. You did. You. How the fuck is a person able to talk about something of a nature of what the fuck you do as well? Explain that shit. You explain that shit, bitch. Hurting, bitch. I pap ain't hurting for a motherfucking thing. Nothing. Nothing. Not even the fucking air that I breathe because it's enough out here for plenty of us. Plenty of us. Stupid bitch. That's what you do best. Twist motherfucking stories up. Turn them. Make them fit your motherfucking narrative so that you can sound good with the way that your ass barking shit out here. That just sounds stupid. That's what you do. All because you want to think that you know what the fuck I was talking about. That's what, that's what you did? You want to think that you know what I know to, why I had a, a reason or that gave me a reason to choose what the fuck I wanted to say and how the fuck I wanted to say it. Seriously? Seriously, bitch? Yeah, yeah, you, 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 yeah, you dumb. You dumb. You, you dumb. You dumb. And it's always the ones that thinks that they're so motherfucking smart, but be so motherfucking dumb because of your motherfucking insinuations. You, bitch. You. You can kiss my motherfucking ass. I knew not to touch your ass. I knew it. I knew it. You same way that you did, same way Bookham did. You did the same motherfucking shit. You don't get no motherfucking pass, bitch. Not over here. Not from Pap. You don't get a pass. It's Team Kale's a hundred, bitch. A hundred. Now, since I'm on this, I'm going to see if you're going to talk about that motherfucking goddamn commentary that Scooby-Doo put down. 
Scooby-Doo just built Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly a whole motherfucking goddamn enterprise, uh, compromise his motherfucking shit. A whole motherfucking one. And with that being said, fuck that nigga too. How about that? I haven't done a motherfucking thing to that man. And that man just constantly want to keep whatever name he chose to uh, uh, align with my name. That wet, wet, motherfucking bullshit, right? He got his own fucking moderator sitting in there telling him, well, you know, these bloggers ain't got shit. I'm trying to see what I'm finna. I got to cook. Yeah, maybe something to eat. I'm hungry. But he, she sat up there and tried to tell him, dude, you know, Mr. Kelly ain't got nothing to do with these bloggers. Like his own moderator. See if you're going to talk about that shit today. That going to use something juicy to talk about, bitch. He said, yes, the fuck it is. Let me show you how he did it. See, this person said he's the godson. This person said he's the, a, a whole motherfucking uh, enough of words for those people to write up a whole motherfucking shit to take to Chicago to do as well. They said that they was going to get all his motherfucking people, the bodyguards, anybody associated and this person and this person well then they need to get Mr. Kelly because these his people basically that's what the fuck he just said over there are you fucking kidding me are you fucking kidding me kidding me if that wasn't a dirty motherfucking move I don't know what the fuck was that was dirty and shady as fuck because a person is individually mad at another person he said yes it is yeah, his own goddamn moderator tried. No, 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 uh-uh. Mr. Kelly ain't got shit to do with the way these bloggers behaving. Scooby-Doo begged a motherfucking differ. Says that Mr. Kelly does. These his people, they working for him. Go talk about that shit. Go talk about that shit. But I guess we'll have to wait and see. If that's going to damage, control Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly as well for the goddamn city trial. We'll wait, we'll wait for that. We'll wait for that. But that was a fucked up ass move that he did. It is what it is. See how I did that? I'm able to talk about that and move the fuck on. I ain't finna dwell on it. I ain't finna dwell on it. It is what it is. Because he'll have to live. He'll have to know. He knows what he says. He knows what he does. Thought it was a strategic ass fucking move because of his anger of getting of saying and trying to get back at what's going on in his situation with the people that he calls out. Right. People that he calls out with periodically want to call some wet, wet, one wet pussy motherfucker shit when he good goddamn. No, I ain't got a motherfucking thing to do with none of that fucking shit. I don't get down like that. I don't get down like that. And if that nigga want to forever stay fucking mad because I said, oh, he was on the fucking balcony saying that, well, I didn't see this nigga doing or he couldn't possibly be doing that. The nigga was on the fucking balcony with the goddamn his girlfriend and the other goddamn girl. I don't know. I forgot her name. The light skinned girl or whatever. Doing nothing but smoking. That nigga took that shit the whole wrong motherfucking way, went left on some shit, and now I can't stand Papoose. I ain't never done shit to the nigga. Ain't looking him up, ain't call, ain't doing none of that motherfucking shit because he a waste of my motherfucking time. Why would I fucking do that? But what does he do in turn? Get a motherfucking picture and put it up on the fucking He ain't never seen. I would never do it. So he could post my shit trillion motherfucking times. My comeback ain't that dirty like that. It ain't that dirty like that. I don't have that dirty, dirty heart like that. We'll never do it. I don't give a fuck about that. That ain't my business well about that. But he had to make it perfectly clear about my business to other people. To a whole nother fucking different level. The only thing that Scooby-Doo has to do. Hmm, yeah. Yeah. Well, that. That part. That part. But that's what he did. Let's see if you're going to talk about that. Now that is something for you to talk about. Was it right? Was it wrong? Attorney, is it gonna hurt Mr. Kelly? Well, what? No. Well, that's that was his just point. Oh, what? How you 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 made an excuse for him earlier? Well, I you know I understand. You know, you know what I mean? And Scooby Doo, uh, uh, anger. You know, he he just don't know how to mind what he's saying when he's angry. You you got that excuse for that nigga, which tells me that you a dick sucking ass motherfucking bitch. Somewhere you have aligned yourself with a little scary boy.
on about this nigga. Some motherfucker where you want to stay copacetic, kosher cool with this nigga. Because you know he could probably get down and get dirty too. So you don't want to cross that line, that low, that thing with him, where you and him then caught, got some little friction or beef and shit going on. But bitch, I must be sitting right here motherfucking waiting with my popcorn. Cause I'm going to drop that motherfucking commentary too as soon as that shit happened, bitch. How about that? I'm going to drop that one too. And don't give a fuck how the fuck it rubs you. None of it. You got short hair? Scratch your motherfucking scalp and get the fuck on with it. Because it is what the fuck it is. It is what the fuck it is. You just can't handle the motherfucking truth. That's your problem. You can't handle the motherfucking truth. That's your fucking problem. Ooh, I can't stand these people where it irks me the most. This your motherfucking words, bitch. Let me remind you. It's a fucking liar. I can't stand a liar. Bitch, the nigga done lied to you multiple motherfucking times right there on that fucking channel. And you set your goofy ass up there with, oh, no, no, keep back. No, keep back. You know. Scary bitch. You's a scary bitch. You is. You want to correct. You want to correct. Be the corrective behavior motherfucking person out here. Then goddamn it, open your mouth up to the nigga and say, whoa, nah, nah, Scooby. You're the hell no, nah, nah, you're lying. You ain't said not one motherfucking time about anything of that goddamn nigga lying. You do know that, right? Not one. You ain't called out one of his motherfucking lies. Not one. Bitch, you a whole motherfucking dick suck. Get the fuck out of here. You bow down, bitch. Bow the fuck down. Bow the fuck down. You gonna correct one since you wants to be the teacher and it's irking your motherfucking nerves. Then, bitch, you correct them all. Don't skip the motherfucking Scooby-Doo. Don't skip. Don't, don't pick and choose who the fuck you want to skip. Keep that shit a, a, a level. Keep that shit balanced and checked, bitch. You can't do that, though, huh? Pap can't. Pap can. Ain't nothing shivering, shaking, or baking over here, bitch. Nothing. Not a motherfucking thing. Nothing. Scary bitch. Now what? So I should get off of here. Let me do my goddamn Christmas shit outside. Because that's what the fuck I got up to do. Because I got grandkids and all that shit that I need to make sure that they happy for. But I had to address your annoying motherfucking ass who thinks you know every motherfucking goddamn thing about fucking YouTube out here. You do. Bitch, you are amateur. I'm an amateur. Scooby-Doo a motherfucking amateur. All these motherfuckers is amateurs. Book them a motherfucking amateur. Everybody motherfucking amateur. You good at, oh, you just want to be like so-and-so. You just want to be like so-and-so. Bitch, pick you a motherfucking hero and be like some motherfucking body. Other than your motherfucking self, because it ain't working. It ain't motherfucking working. Not at all. It ain't working for you. Not at all, bitch. No, not at all. Not a goddamn thing. Nothing. Nothing. Well, tell me, Pap, you ain't no motherfucking body, bitch. I ain't no, bitch. I'm who I say I am. I'm one papoose. You can't change that. Your narrative can't change it. Not, not, not nothing. Nothing, bitch. Pap is good. She good. Good. Stupid bitch. Oh, man. I'd be glad when you goddamn it go sill away and sit your ass down so that we don't never have to hear about it. Uh, I don't. I don't know about the people out there. I'm sick of hearing about the goddamn shit. To be perfectly fucking honest with you. And that's the only time I plan to turn up on your ass. Because I'm going to defend myself with you and this whole motherfucking man motherfucking bullshit, bitch. Fucking man? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm not the one in the picture riding on a nigga back. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nah. You could chill with the hair shit. Cause that little bald head ass thumbnail is yours. That picture stand right the fuck up on my motherfucking thumbnail so that we can remind you. We need to remind your motherfucking ass that you used to rock a two inch motherfucking afro, bitch. Afro sheen 
having weird ass bitch. <laughs> You had to, uh, you know, in order to keep that shit like that, like it was looking on that picture, right? You had to put a little sheen to it, a little, little bit. Oh, you you know that, right, bitch? You know that, right? Or your ass would have been looking like Kuta Kente motherfucking wife. So shut the fuck up, bitch. Shut the fuck up. Period. You sitting over there like you was a whole motherfucking glamour girl all your motherfucking life. Bitch, you had wide hips just like motherfucking Angela. And you got the motherfucking nerve in that motherfucking blue jean motherfucking skirt standing in fucking dirt with sandals. You dirty bitch. Put your toes in for you standing there on that fucking gravel. Shut the fuck up, bitch. There was nothing spectacular, nothing spectacular about your motherfucking life. Like you just an elevator up over everybody out here on these motherfucking YouTubes. Bitch, you look like you was fucking homeless and struggling with them Dollar General ass motherfucking flip flops in high school. And you got motherfucking nerves to be motherfucking talking. You got motherfucking nerves to be talking. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? The nigga you was hugged up, which with nigga, that wasn't no Prince Charm ass motherfucker either. I I, I tried to even get, uh, I, I zoomed in, bitch. All my shit ended up with motherfucker spider webs. Well, I couldn't, I couldn't even say, mm. bitch, you ain't even have a nigga that I looked at that said, mm. bitch, you, you, you ain't got one. You ain't got a nigga that I can look at to say, mm, mm. I looked at that picture and I was like, yikes, bitch. You, that was a whole motherfucking high school gorilla. The fuck? The fuck, bitch? You ain't got no taste? You don't know how to fucking pick them? Is that your problem? You, you, you just interested in motherfucking gorillas. The fuck out of here. The fuck out of here. Wide hip. I see why you took all the motherfucking gym classes, bitch. You, you were working that motherfucking shit off. Pap came like this here, bitch. Let me show you. Pap came with this. Ain't going to get no motherfucking bigger and no motherfucking little bitch and right here. All in motherfucking tack. And like I tell you, this ain't what the fuck you want. This ain't what the fuck you want. Bitch, I didn't have 80 motherfucking pounds to lose at the age of 20. Nah, bitch. Mm -mm. I didn't have to pick up a motherfucking diet to get crude. Bitch came like this. Came like this dangerous motherfucking jeans from RC and Miss Ann, bitch. Dangerous motherfucking jeans. If you see my mom body at the age of seven, three, bitch, you'll be like, holy fuck. What the fuck are you, bitch? Bitch. But from your little history and shit that your ass putting up, I got your motherfucking ass over here dropping all kind of motherfucking excuses and opinion, all, uh, theories and opinions and this, why, this, like that. You are explaining ass motherfucking bitch, too. You know that, right? You are a whole explaining motherfucking bitch. And you know when a bitch got to do some explaining on some shit, right? Then them nervous type ass motherfuckers. Narcissist ass. You are a narcissist. A narcissist explains every motherfucking thing because they need an excuse, a way to change the story, to get their way out of some shit, a whole bunch of, you name it, you name it, bitch. You a narcissist. Pap ain't explaining a motherfucking thing to you. If I said it, I said it. If I did it, I did it, bitch. It's just as simple as that. You got an excuse about the who, what, when, where's, and the why's. Oh, gorilla dating ass bitch. That, that's your type. That's your type. You shouldn't put that. No, you shouldn't never put that motherfucking picture up, nigga. I'm talking about every one of your motherfucking niggas. Uh-huh, I am. And I'm going to talk about your wide, hip, blue jean, 1970, wearing flip-flop, having ass. That's what I'm going to do. Short hair, don't care. That's the mode that you was in, bitch. Whole Afro sheen. But you want to talk about a fucking part. A part. A part. <laughs> you should have aparted from that motherfucking Afro. Mm-hmm. Should have parted. I see you with your little long ass big earrings. I understand why the people wear the big earrings with the short hair don't motherfucking care afros. Because you got the camouflage of, hey, I'm not no motherfucking nigga. But when I kind of zoomed in and the bitch, you kind of had that little stash up underneath the nose there too. I'm, I ain't trying to point that out. I don't know if it's still there. But back then, you, 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 you had that shadow. You didn't cut that shit. You, you weren't perfect. Now I got to sit here and look at your ass in a whole motherfucking workout plan, bitch. You in the mirror, pow, 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 pow. Success is a motherfucker, ain't it? 
You work them motherfucking hips off of your motherfucking ass. You work them off. See, people like me, we just keep it shaped. I just keep it shaped, bitch. You had to work it off. <laughs> no carbs, no sodas, no salt, no sugar having ass, bitch. I eat the shit. I eat the shit. My bill of health is good. The grace of God has blessed me. I'm good. But I also am aware that I'm getting older. So I have to be a little bit very careful with it because of the way that they're making the shit out here now. The way that they done put all this goddamn side spraying shit. All oh, you know, all that. Uh, I be careful with that shit though, girl. I be careful. But I love to fuck me up some goddamn chicken ranch pizza. I ain't gonna motherfucking lie. I'll fuck a chicken ranch pizza up, girl. Love the fuck out the motherfuckers. But I know my limit to them. Well, I ain't got to go work it off. I just gotta keep it in shape. <laughs> How about that, bitch? You should have never posted. And I got them all. Same way you got your shit. Same way. Same way. Same way. I'm just not as dirty, dirty as people are. They don't need to post all your shit up. I could just talk about them. That's it. Let's talk about how you had a little struggle in life. And how you still struggling in your life. Compromise. You compromise, bitch. You can't move. You can't move. Mm -mm. Got to wait and see if that nigga going to buy you out. Fuck if you if you on top and if you got it like that, bitch, you ain't got to wait. Pap ain't got to wait. I ain't even finna discuss it with a nigga. When I'm ready to bounce, you can have this shit. I'm out of here. It's just that simple. I don't have problem with it. I can write every motherfucking check and cash every last one of them bitches. Imagine that. No, you got to wait. I want to see if my daughter, and, and he going to put the money to my daughter so then I can, and then she can get the money and to me, and I'm now you finna involve your daughter in all your whole ass shit. <laughs> you gonna involve your daughter because you got to make a dick, you got to make a dick run. Trey Song says the store run, but I call it the dick run. <laughs> You got you got to go make a dick run, boo. Huh? But you can't do it yet because the other dick is compromising your situation. That's a fucked up situation to be in. But had you uh, read my, my, my book of player, my, my, my book, bitch, you wouldn't be in that compromised situation. I'm your girl. I can show you how to move dick right and get all out there, bitch. Bitch, it never get the fuck caught. You feel what I'm saying? I'm your girl for that shit. If I choose to live that fucking life again. Well, you got an old little boy, a little stale father. But let me know if you, when you ready to ride the fuck up out that dead dick up in there and get you the new dick. But I'm going to help you out. I'm going to help you out. Even through the goddamn bitterness and shit. I, I, God has spoken. God has spoken. Yeah, he's spoken. I wish I knew that damn gospel song. I love that gospel song. He's spoken. Mm -hmm. Told me to help your compromising thirsty dick whole ass out. That's what he said. Help your whole ass out. I just said, God, you know how I feel about this old whole thirsty ass hoe. He says, I know, Pat, but you're good people. And I done blessed you with so much. And and uh, uh, what's the name to say? Pass it on, bitch. I help you. All the fuck I'm gonna do now. He just said help you. He didn't say how much I had to help you, bitch. The only thing I'm gonna do is just book your motherfucking reservations, and you gonna pay for that shit. <laughs> so let's get a perfectly understanding before I log off and then you go write your whole motherfucking biography or you missing breakfast and shit because you being told that I'm on the motherfucking live talking about your ass. So you probably laying in your orthopedic ass motherfucking bed and then hit the up button to raise your neck and shit up and all that motherfucking goofy shit. Right. And so you could get all my words exactly right. And you probably over there steno graphing some shit. You probably got the whole motherfucking machine laying in the bed to shorthand the shit. 
shit so you can get the shit right because you're going to come back and I'm going to be a whole bunch of old bag of bitches and, and this and that and that man shit and all that motherfucking bullshit. So I'm going to be waiting, girl. Let me do I need popcorn for this shit. Let me let me get some popcorn. Because I ain't going to lie. I'm sure you coming back to crack me the fuck up on some shit that I don't give a fuck about. <laughs> I'm sure you are. I'm sure you are. Now, is there anything that you missed? Put a one in the chat and then you can take your ass back in the bushes and then I will repeat it so that you can get it. You can put that one in that motherfucker. Tell, send your people. Put one in the chat if you need me to repeat some shit to your motherfucking self. <laughs> Players going to play, you better say it. Ballers going to ball, you, you know it. You know it, girl, you know it. Anyways, I hope all of y'all have a beautiful Sunday. But I got reindeers and, and, and trees and shit and lights and shit to put up and, and run to Costco and this shit to do with my laundry. Give me a little bit of breakfast. And now this is where I get to say, now, bitch, I just gave you some motherfucking commentary. How about that? That's what they like to say, right? I'm learning this shit, y'all. I just, I, ooh, I just gave you some commentary. Now you can come back and say some shit. You can say it or you can write it any, any way you choose to do. It ain't going to make or break me or change my motherfucking thoughts up about nothing about how I do my one papoose motherfucking channel over here. None at all. But I'm going to sit and wait for that day for you two motherfuckers. To actually get into it. Oh, I'm waiting, bitch. I'm waiting. I got my shit on speed dial start button, baby. I'm waiting. So you better kiss that nigga ass as long as you can and keep sucking the juice out his motherfucking ass over there. When you know that nigga done set up there and told more than one motherfucking lie for to a person who can't stand a motherfucker that lies. So you sucking him down mentally. Ooh, or is you trying to infiltrate mentally on his motherfucking channel? Is that what you is that what you plan on doing? Is that is that what y'all doing? Is that what you doing? Is that what you motherfucking doing? You yeah, in a minute it's gonna be about him too, right? In a minute. That's what you're doing. See, he had it figured out. He has it figured out. I'm gonna say this shit before I go so you could get a clear motherfucking understanding. You know? Scooby Doo had that shit figured out. But see, he's strategic too. Everybody's strategic. He shut it down. He asked your motherfucking ass. He asked you, clear as day. One specific motherfucking questions, but you went to do around the roses ass bullshit. Start talking about somebody else getting loud, over talked them, and all that motherfucking shit. You heard that nigga ask you about your situation or whatever with the drunken Larry shit. You heard him. You heard him. He asked you. He asked you. And I know you're going to come back and say, hey, you're lying and you're lying and you're like a bitch because I ain't finna go back and find the time mark on it. But you know he asked you because you got loud. He didn't want to answer that motherfucking shit. Uh-uh. He touched on the same motherfucking thing that I'm touching on right motherfucking now, but he stood down. He stood down, strategic. And that could possibly be, in my opinion, because he ain't done with your motherfucking asses yet. Uh-uh. Because that's how he fucking moved. He ain't done with y'all asses. He ain't done doing his, his homework. He ain't done yet. But you best to believe when that nigga get done over there, over there, that motherfucking rice lord over there, oh, he gonna drop on your ass too. Oh, yeah. He ain't done. He digging. He searching. He looking up. He getting your shit together, bitch. You on the chopping block. You own it, so don't think that your motherfucking laugh got you a pass with that nigga. Uh-uh. It's a strategic ass nigga. It's fucked up. But Pap, she ain't gonna hold no motherfucking bars. You touch that fucking dirt down there. You touch that dirty ass nigga. You done had multiple conversations with that fucking nigga. Whether if it's VIA Cora motherfucking links or when he was at home on the fucking messenger or the whichever way you want to talk about it. A kite, I don't give a fuck. You touched him. You dirty. I don't give a fuck if you sit neutral or not. You don't get to sit motherfucking neutral. And act like you're talking and discussing uh, any element of Mr. Robert Sylvester Kelly's case 
at all. Stay your motherfucking ass over there in my DJ motherfucking or dad's motherfucking voice. Keep that shit over there. We A lot of people ain't touching Booker for the same fucking goddamn reason. So what makes you think that you motherfucking special? What makes you think you special? You get a pass. You ain't getting no motherfucking pass over here. Now, when I ain't straddling no motherfucking fist, I rock one motherfucking way all day, every day. Team motherfucking chaos. I'm for R. Kelly. You straddle a fence ass bitch. All that fake neutral ass shit. Why? So you can get in people ears. So you can get on the phone and get the information of what the fuck they need and what the fuck they saying. By golly, if your soulmate that shit came out for R. Kelly and he didn't fed you a whole bunch of shit about what he how he feels and what he knows, and you done fed that shit on down the line to the fucking crucifier. Mm-hmm. And that's how his ass is able to strategically fucking move out here on these fucking streets with the letters and the, and the shit that he be posting up. You make that shit make sense. You make it make sense. But you full of shit. Period. And I done been to a lot of motherfucking farms. I ain't been to the funny farm yet until I touch down here on YouTube. But I done been to farms, bitch, to zoos and everything. And uh, then let me tell you this. Your manure smells just like the motherfuckers that I done passed up. Even in Arizona. I like going to the zoo. And that's what your shit smell like. Just like the motherfucking dirty-ass animals at the motherfucking zoos. You are dirty, dirty bitch. So I just can't be about book. Nah. Yeah, add your ass to the list too now. You a crossover. You a bitch. You ain't shit. You can't fuck with me. And that's why I say I don't fuck with people like you. You don't know which way to go when the fucking wind blows. And as far as I'm concerned, you chose your weapon. You picked your poison. You got your struggle. Now step the fuck down off of one path. Because if you don't, and if you want to keep coming back, changing my narration up about my motherfucking goddamn channel of what the fuck I talk about when you don't know why I say the things that the fuck I choose to say. You don't know who the fuck and what the fuck I was knowing out here. The only thing you can do is sit your ass neutral like you say you are. And I'm going to, you can listen to it or you not. But if you're going to come out and change some shit up and think that you know what the fuck I'm saying and why the fuck I'm saying, I got a motherfucking problem. And I'm going to address it. And if it happens to be with you, then it's with you. If you don't want it to be with you, then it don't have to be. It's just called shut the fuck up. Period. Shut the fuck up. You claim you got all the people, you fulfilling their needs of what they want to hear, what they say. Kudos to you. Kudos to you. I don't give a fuck. I'm not unloyal. I'm not. I have dignity. I have fucking pride. Maybe that's something that you should try to get instead of trying to portray that you have that shit. You're a whole undercover ass conniving whole ass bitch and you're dirty and on that note you guys have a beautiful goddamn sunday i got to go out here and mess around with electricity have a good day you guys bye bye